Fredless being an online t-shirt community um, based brand, we fell in love with the whole concept. The fact that the community service announcements were born online, as was Threadless, and we both share that same philosophy that it's it's all about the community, and the community pretty much chooses what they love, and then they they you know, it begins to grow from theirs. I mean, I think all up, I've had about like 800 of them so far. I, I draw about, say, say three or so every evening, and then in the AM, I sort of ink it all up and then add them onto FB, you know, onto the internet and everything. We didn't and really have any grand plan for it at the beginning. It yeah. was, was more of a, uh, almost a, not necessarily an experiment, but more of a continuation of sharing our art online. A lot of people were saying that they wanted to have exhibitions of it and bring it into a gallery environment. Or well, they uh, were invited to um, put it on to, into environments which was actually in the street or in a square. So it's now grown outside of and beyond the internet, which has become a part of the public arena. People print these out and they have them up on their desks and people have this connection with it. So it's, it's spread on its own, which is really beautiful. So I've always been into art for everyone. I think art ought to be yep. inclusive as opposed to exclusive. And as soon as you add that image onto a shirt, mm -hmm. it is for, for everyone. It's accessible and it's taking it outside of a gallery environment, it's taking it off the walls and it's putting it onto the people.